Yeah, for me training at Box Heart, it's it's a unique experience. Um, I thought it was gonna be easy, but no, it's not. And I like it. I like it that it's not easy. It's that way you can push, and push. And they, they push to the limit. We sweat a lot. Yeah, you see. But yeah, I love it. Like I said before, I uh, left Cuba in uh, 2007. I came in a boat. I crossed the sea without my family knowing about it. And uh, it was hard to leave my family in uh, Cuba. I came here when I was 18 years old by myself. Um, zero experience, uh, zero English. But I always had that dream going. Like, you know, I want to fight, I want to fight, I want to train. How bad do they want it? All right here in the gym. In the gym. How bad do you want it? Put the work in the gym so you breathe and the fight time comes. But you gotta put that work in right here. That's where it starts. Come on. So look, Ed came to me um, at a time that I thought we already had our team and all the fighters. It, it was actually a contact to, through Hector. Ever since Ed came into the gym, great, great energy, great person, great heart. From the get-go, even without us even training, he offered to even promote Boxer, the gym. So when he did that, he showed me that there was love towards the gym already from the get-go. And I showed him love when he walked in. So when he asked me, he said, look, I want to I wanna fight. I want to get ready for this BKFC fight. And it was quick. I said, all right, bro, I got you. I'm, I'm going to do what it takes to get you in there and to win. But I just need you to pay attention. We're going we're gonna to work on the things that you really need work on, hone them, and make them happen. And he's been putting it together, which I'm very, very happy about. Now it's a matter of just putting in the next three and a half weeks before the fights come up. We'll have that shit tweeted, ready, go in, full force, and we'll make it happen. There's something, there's something special about him, like I say about the other fighters. Every fighter has something special about him that they got to bring to the table. And there is something about him. Can't work it out yet, but it's there. And it's gonna work. So I think I think what it is one of those things. Cuba, we don't we don't have this. Uh, we wish, but we don't. And uh, I always say that once I make it to the United States, I'm gonna be a fighter. And uh, now I got the opportunity. Um, I'm working hard. I have a I have a job. My job. I'm a property manager. So I work during the day. I came here and train, and I go back to work again to 5 p.m. And then I go back to train again at 7 p.m. It's a lot of hard. It's it's, it's it's hard, but that's that's the way it is. And um, I thanks Mateo and Jason for the opportunity. And like I say again, I feel super happy here. I like to buy. I like the crew. And uh, I feel like I'm home. Damn rep. My father is funny because he, he just not he just know that I told him that I was gonna fight two days ago. My mom she doesn't know that I'm doing this. Uh, I'm still thinking how the way I'm gonna tell it. But I know she's gonna support me. Even though she doesn't like home sport, but I know. Go, 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 go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Come on. All day. Let's go. Pop it. Ha, ha. Before, you gotta catch my hand. Ha, ha. There you go. Ha, ha. I ain't coming to you. You're coming to me. Ha, ha. Step in the Ha, ha. There you go. And now that I got the opportunity on, on bare knuckle, I like to train in the clinch because I do a lot, lot of, a lot of uh, dropping. Uh, I believe my strength. Uh, I hit hard. And uh, that's, when you put all the pieces together, uh, I mean, the result is. It's, 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 100% uh, uh, for sure, like, we are gonna get the victory, no matter what. Hold them on, hold them. Spins, right there, stay on top of his hands, he right there. June 26th, we all ready. Um, training hard, every single day, non-stop, even on the weekends. And, um, ready for the win, victory. Uh, representing it right here, Miami, Latin community, I'm Cuban, and uh, there'll be a lot of Cubans on that day for sure. And uh, that's it, man. Working non stop. That's right, right. That's right. Working non stop, and I love it because uh, boxing dirty tactics. These are old moves that uh, get points taken away, and <laughs> you get.
deducted, disqualified, and a lot of those moves are allowed in the bare knuckle fight. Holding, punching, spinning them, locking them hold, using your arms, different positions, and hey, I love it. Put all the dirty moves together, bam, get them. Hands, nice right there. So now I got you, right? Hands yeah. up. And then try to move to your side, any side. You see? Wow. Wow. This week, yep. next yep. week, the week after, you double it up. You train as hard oh, yeah. as you can. You work on the technique and the things that he gives you, what I give you, and you put it together, you gel it already by just seeing this. Keep it going. Keep the, going. the camera's on, bro. The camera doesn't lie. When you watch the video and you go back to the first time we started, you're going to be like, oh shit. So, no, I know. you got to look at those things. What you bring to the table is what it's all about. A whole lot more than the guy, right? That's wrong. Knockout. That's it. I don't need to go five rounds. I don't need brother. to go four rounds. Three rounds, six rounds. No. Third round. That's it. We got the victory. Listen. Done. Done. Thanks to you, Mateo. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes in the past, I mean, I could have five dollars to eat like a burger. But um, I always believe in myself. I always believe in my, my family. They always support me. Even through the, um, I don't know, like phone call. You know, to never give up. And that's uh, today. Uh, I have a decent appointment. I have a decent life. Uh, today I feel like I'm doing what I want. Uh, even 15 years later, but you know, I'm, I'm happy that I still can do it. And I'm doing it. Quiero tomar un momentito de esta entrevista y mandarle un saludo a toda la comunidad latina especialmente a todos los cubanos dentro y fuera de la isla que siguen el canal Box Art la pelea será en junio 26 eh, estaré presentando a todos los latinos la victoria va segura eh, gracias por el apoyo de todos y, y no se pierdan no se pierdan la pelea va a ser un show muy muy grande estamos trabajando muy duro para eso este nada más que todo un saludo a mi mamá a mi papá a toda mi familia y a todos los amigos míos que me apoyan Y un saludo muy, muy, muy especial a mi jefa, Sara, por darme la oportunidad de salir del trabajo y venir acá a entrenar. Gracias.